Yo, what's up guys? Before we get into the movie, I just wanted to say there's a few spots in this movie where the words get cut off. A lot of copyright issues went into this one and there was a lot of parts that we had to trim out and stuff. And we got a brand new editor on our team. And this is his very first project, his very first movie that he's ever edited. So I'm really excited to have him and we're gonna continue to just do better in the future, man. So thank you guys so much for tuning in like always. And we're gonna continue to hopefully get out more content because we just added a new member to our team. So show him some love guys, like the video. Uh, I want him to see the video and see a bunch of likes on it so he can feel good about his work because he definitely deserves it. It was a long movie and he put in a lot of effort. So thank you so much, guys. Let's go. I don't know. Maybe we could be like, hey, guys, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching the Eternals. You know, obviously we're on that journey and we've been having a real good time. Like, comment, subscribe. This has got a lot of Game of Thrones characters in it. Maybe we could do something like that. You think I can make something with that and edit? No. That was going to be my intro. Like, oh. I was just trying to figure out an intro. Oh, yeah. You like that? That's good. I didn't ever thought of that before. Scrap all that. Yo, what's up, guys? Let's go. Okay. Arsham, the prime celestial, created the first sun and brought light into the universe. Life began and thrived. All was in balance. Until an unnatural <laughs> species of predator emerged from deep space to feed on intelligent life. They were known as deviants. The universe was plunged into chaos. To restore the natural order, Arishem sent Eternals and mortal heroes from the planet Olympia to eliminate the Deviants. Eternals had unyielding faith in Arishem until one mission led by the Prime Eternal Ajax changed everything. So this sounds like some mythological. I like how they highlighted the important things we need to know. I think it was all important. That was the whole plot of the movie, wasn't it? <laughs> Whoa. Amua, Amua. No, I'm just kidding. That's that was a like unique a, one. That's a triangle right there. Did you see it? It's like a puzzle piece. What the hell? It is time. Dang. That thing ignited her? She didn't even cough. Dang, it just puts on their uniform like that? If I was a superhero, I would just wear gym shorts. <laughs> and a t-shirt. That'd be so <laughs> flexible. It's beautiful, isn't it? King of the North. Her name's Cersei. She's like, don't kill me, Trey. <laughs> Mesopotamia. 5,000 BC. Do you know what Mesopotamia is? Yeah. What? Those were like... Life started and all that? Yeah, it was like the middle. You sure that's like oh, Africa? Got shot. Egypt. <gasps> what? Oh yeah, you're right. Because the Fertile Crescent. Okay, two bees. If I was that little kid, I'd pee on my damn self. Let's go, Rob. No, he's Icarus in this one. Let's go, Icarus. Oh, Icarus, Dickery, Doc. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because he does. Who needs guns when you got that? Just one time, I want to see someone generate an energy field like that and actually throw it and not just come out my eye. Like, I want to see somebody swing that thing like Roger. Oh, you know look saying? at her costume. Sorry, just, just distracted by that awesome costume. Was that like a, that was easy type of situation? I think so. We got a thing like Cyclops. I said, thank you guys. Uh, somebody grabbed my pen <laughs> and a scroll. Hell no. That's insane. What the heck? They're just... What? Some things would freak me out. Is that like mind control? Yeah, that's why it freaked me out. Oh. They upgraded it. That's kind of wild, right? They didn't talk at all. Did you notice that? <laughs> yeah, but they about to talk their ass off in this movie, though. Once we're about to watch a silent film. <laughs> like Charlie Chaplin or something. London? That's where Leon Edwards is from. Oh, she knows about that artifact. So she's just living that modern life, huh? Artifacts that shape human history. Yeah, when she's the one who shaped that artifact. I like the choice of Pink Floyd time. Closed. <gasps> the new safe. king of the north. The central heart. Still leading the nice watch. <laughs> Sorry, I'm late, everyone. 
Today we'll be learning about the importance of apex predators in a balanced ecosystem. Isn't it funny they're both so, after Cersei? <laughs> Just kidding. Who can tell me? Who can give me an example? Lions! Wolves. Correct? <laughs> Lions and wolves. <laughs> this is Game of Thrones. It's all right. Come here. Yeah, Magneto. Magneto done played that card before. I don't know what happened to him. Mm-hmm. Not to mention that was Charles Xavier's school for the gifted right there. Oh, <laughs> <Little> water bug. <laughs> Honestly, I think I was looking at him. It's weird to see this guy like have a personality. Oh, yeah. Wait, what the hell? You've had too much to drink. I got. Whoa. She's like Mystique. Happy birthday, dear Maybe we should stop pointing out all the parallels. We might make some people mad. Oh, sorry, guys. It's just. I'll, I don't know. Maybe I watch those for reasons, I guess. Maybe. Have you given any more thought to us moving in together? <laughs> I thought about it. <laughs> She's denied on like that? I, are you a wizard? Uh, what? Yeah, like Doctor Strange. No, I'm. <laughs> Some unusual things happen when I'm around you. Like our water always turns to coffee. It's caffeine. <laughs> <laughs> like you and your ex-boyfriend broke up a century ago. She said that. <laughs> and he can. Are you really in love? What if I am? Oh, he's gonna have to find out. She might have to fight this thing. Oh, and that's how he's about to put it all together <laughs> and realize he's right. Okay. Oh no. I wonder if they're after him, her. Oh, she concrete his men. Yes. What is that thing? I did it! You said you killed them all! Leave me! I do now! <laughs> You're fine, dude. Sprite! You're fine, dude. No stairs. <laughs> Hey man. Wow. So who's real and who's not, huh? Who's that gonna be? The boyfriend? Oh yeah, ex-boyfriend pulls up. Two bees. <laughs> oh, this moment right here. Icarus. <laughs> Did he just turn that driver into flowers? That's crazy. She did, I think. <laughs> Oh, he fell on the petal bushes. Why the most romantic thing ever happened to him? Did it just heal itself? Yeah, so how do you kill it? That thing's an American candy. <laughs> That's funny. I wonder what's in there. Icarus, it's good to see you. <laughs> Hello, Dane. Well, I guess you must be the pilot. <laughs> so we're about to have like a third world triangle situation yeah <laughs> we're eternals from a planet called olympia <laughs> look if you don't want to move in with me you could just say <laughs> hey, <this is> <laughs> oh i know we were instructed not to interfere in any human conflicts unless deviants are involved Why? that's what i was wondering too but if we've been waiting to be told we can go home told by who maybe their boss the that red thing how long were you two together Five thousand years. <laughs> well, that's a I lot of. Go that long term. It's a lot of history, wow. huh? Something's happening to Earth. Can't be a coincidence. I'm sorry, I hurt you, Cersei. Yeah, you should be. But she moved on. Mm -hmm. Family reunion. It's about time. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's what he did on Train to Busan, pretty much. Protected the people at that door. So this is cool though, so they're like uh, mythological beings 
And obviously the stories came from the fact that throughout the centuries they've been fighting these, what are they called? Deviants. So, deviants, yeah. So they're just protecting... Saying. All this is about to just get recorded in a damn cave somewhere. Ain't nobody gonna believe it. <laughs> Man, my dude, there was lions with human heads and hybrids and... They really like their, their kudos, don't they? They always line up and they're just... You know what I mean? They look at the people and they just want that respect. But I feel like they have mind control, so maybe they erase it or something. They can develop properly. Yes, it, it's very dry in here today. Sorry. Oh my gosh. Hey, Jack. Arshan, more people have come to seek refuge. The eternal serving the missions across the galaxies will learn from your success. Dang, there's more. Do not become attached to this planet. You must focus on the true purpose of your mission. Hmm. I will not let you down. That was like the grand designer. Ereshem? Well, he needs some lotion on his nose. He's gonna look crusty. <laughs> That's the ship. Fastos. Who's talking to you? Get a life. <laughs> And where is Cersei? I'm sorry, but I have something very exciting to show you, okay? <laughs> Wait till you see this. Whoa. What is it? it it's an engine. So they invented the steam engine? <laughs> you know, where you use your mind to control them and then they could do it quicker. Hey, Jack, you listen to this. Fastos? <laughs> steam. Engine. It's a steam engine. It's too engine. soon. <laughs> and there she is. What did I miss? Screams of my deep disappointment. I am sure they said they had. Mad. They said they had the Simple. wheel for a thousand okay, years and let's... haven't done anything like that. Uh, well, I feel ripped off. Like they got zero gentlemen. propulsion energy over there. Is they're giving me a steam engine. <laughs> the plow. <laughs> <laughs> Plows. Humanity may be coming along slower than some of us want, but there is no telling what wonders they will discover as they advance. Such an optimistic lady. <laughs> Yeah, hyping them up. There's so many other chairs, man. <laughs> I didn't come to this planet to cower behind walls. Yeah, we need to trust Arashim's design for this planet. So it seems like there's a divide and you. between if they like this grand design or not. Right. Yeah. Elton Apatani. Mimulu Halekani la Tara Tupi Saraki Sarak Zamarima. Doesn't this just feel like a Lannister dinner? <laughs> yeah. Stop yourself, stop hitting yourself. And she also says that stealing is very, very bad. So obviously she's right. Mm -hmm. They shouldn't interfere. So she's stealing and he's interfering with humans. <laughs> They're all happy now. <laughs> I promise I won't let my feelings for Cersei distract me from our mission. Your faith in Arisham is strong, but you are allowed to live a life. Go tell Cersei how you feel. Aww. She's like helping them thrive without them knowing. He was out there making a rapist. Like, but damn, house is that? It's a broom house, ain't it? Madish Benako. Wait, what did I say? You said, I am very beautiful. You are very beautiful, Cersei. What a beautiful damn moment. There's a twinkle in my eye. I love seeing I love seeing that guy happy because <laughs> he's not gonna be it's just how remember because we know they broke up mm, just never works out for him well it did for 5,000 years at least the man had to think about it do I say it back <laughs> he said because uttering the words I love you Cersei is like poison five seconds later yeah, but to be honest, I'm really digging these shots in this movie, though. Yeah. I love the way it looks. I like how it's going through, like, different places, like, throughout history. Wow, that's so beautifully, like, it's so colorful. You saw the main lady crying. <laughs> that was so sweet. Dang, so she was going through all that in her head. 
<laughs> Out Man, don't let your exes though. ride together across South Dakota. <laughs> hey, Jack. Oh, no. Hey, Jack. <gasps> That's their leader. Oh, she's dead, dead, huh? Her face looked terrible. She's been out there for a minute. You think a deviant got her? It was a deviant. Yeah, so. There you go. That explains it. Mm hmm. Mystery number one's out the way. So Ajax's power was to heal herself. Right. <gasps> In order. It's about to get sucked up by one of those monsters, probably. Really? I was thinking it was going to be a message. Maybe it's choosing her. He's like, hey, go be the leader now. No, the oh, so of she the can universe. heal herself maybe now. Now she's talking oh. to this dude that we're all divided about. So oh, almost time. Cersei, Cersei, are you? No, go back. We need to hear what what it's time for. Are you sure you talked to Tharsha? Mod weary. Whatever that word is. I think to know Titlin. <laughs> I think I've learned that we sound a lot less dumb if we don't try. Oh, okay, <laughs> to knock Titlin. <gasps> no! Ugh. Thank goodness gracious. That was really Gunshots. Cool. Yeah, how? This is BC, right? Maybe, yeah. Or it's 80. Genocide. Everyone is going to die. Oh, no. Oh, no! <laughs> Why is she tripping on everybody? You better back up, bro. She'll stab you. Oh. I was say, aren't they eternal, though? Oh, shoot. What happened? Athena. You went you dark. Man, I reset we her hard drive. We've trusted you for 7,000 years, and look where you got us. Is he Irish? I know, right? When I could stop it all in the heartbeat. Yeah, I think so. Are we really helping these people build a better world, huh? The mission in question, yet again. So this is that divide I was talking about. People either believe in the mission or they don't. But this dude over here is essentially doing the same thing that he's accusing the other guy of doing. Putting it all, taking it all out of their hands. Mm -hmm. Might not be good for them, but at least it's their fate. Stop. Don't be had a car start. The parallel vibes I'm getting are X Men. I feel like that's why y'all wanted us to watch X Men so I could understand these people. Hey, did you see that guy's mohawk? Right on, brother. Because that gives me Dark Phoenix vibes. I hate to say it. That just gave me supernatural vibes. <laughs> oh, that's when they all got the big she's split. Oh, she's a nice leader. <laughs> <laughs> that's what he's up to. Is he on Broadway or something? <laughs> Maybe like their version of Broadway. <laughs> <laughs> They're just watching it. <laughs> He's like a Bollywood star. So he look he never found his purpose. <laughs> that is his purpose. He's having a damn good time. <laughs> you can't take those facial expressions. <laughs> Cut! <laughs> Hey, he's not bad though. Well, you could always do better. He gave his team the. His friends from college are here. Perfect timing. I'm playing you. You like the costume? <laughs> we need to tell the director. I have some notes. Very close, though. I'll let you know. Oh, I have to get ready for the next scene. Come to my tent. We'll talk there. Damn, they be shutting down the lights before they even get out the building. That's a violation. Of where we're from. You need to for that. First of a trilogy. Would you call BTS to do a cameo? Like BTS. Life affords no greater duty than to protect one's family. Dang, so at this point, he's a whole actor. <laughs> Guys, I'm be honest with y'all. I don't know a damn thing about BTS. I ain't never heard it or none of that. Years. No, you heard that song. Which one? That's how uh, oh, bad I between uh, the two. Uh, like yeah, Whoa. that oh, one. That's that Fortnite song? Mm -hmm. Well, I am, but I am also. The documentary? Tell them about yourself. Like the road mic. Oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> I can change a rock into... What's wrong with that? That was a good one. Says, oh. <laughs> I think they're quite good. 
that yeah. Because they don't age, so she's amused by that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that is my great grandfather. <laughs> grandfather. So he's created I'm like this whole the family. Dynasty yeah. The <laughs> impressive, right? I thought we were friends. Oh, she's always a kid. Mm -hmm. That's gotta suck. Dang, the cameraman's filming it. Where did they just walk from? This? This? No, it's hideous. <laughs> You've never had one try to bite your head off. I thought it was kind of beautiful, too. <laughs> Kiss the cook. I'm real haggard. Oh, valet. Like Alfred in Batman. <laughs> That's why it's so cut up right now. I'm sorry, Gil. Ajax's dead. Dang. Blueberry. You think it was blueberry because now he's blue? Dang. Mm. Oh, he's super strong. Dang. You didn't see that that pattern right there in the ground, just like in Game of Thrones. Did you mm -hmm. see that? Yeah, and that's like Red Dead Redemption. Associate. This thing's on the tree. Uh oh. Centurion Six is a planet, right? Remember who you are. That's cool that it's Athena, not Athena, in this one. Call it for kids. <laughs> <laughs> I gave. <you. laughs> and and Sprite's like a million years old. All right. Yours is a secret room. All in. Oh, you'll go mess. mess yeah. <laughs> now he's a famous Avenger and won't return my calls. <laughs> so now that Captain Rogers and Iron Man are both gone. They just made another Game of Thrones joke. He said, I could lead them. I figured I'd be good at that. He led his men straight to the slaughter. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, but they also said, he said, Thor used to follow me around as a little kid. <laughs> uh, yeah, <laughs> now he's too cool. Oh. oh. Is this the Century 6 Thena was talking about? They it's always name planets like Century and stuff. Mm -hmm. so. We had an unprecedented global earthquake three days ago. It's extremely impressive that man can speak Mandarin and English. Like just without an accent or anything right. just well. Well, I don't know if he has an accent in Mandarin. I don't speak it, but he didn't sound like he did. Well, I mean, he obviously knows Korean too because he was in Train to Busan. That's what it was. Just had a little Thea Vaughn moment right there. <laughs> well, I didn't know what that was. <laughs> And then I realized this is an extraordinarily long finger. You were sent to Earth to bring forth the Celestial Tiamat. Tiamat. I plant celestial seeds into host planets across the universe. This sounds like Guardians of the Galaxy, though. Yeah, his dad. Man, that's crazy as hell. I know. They so had a whole mission. It's like Ragnarok. Mm -hmm. Sucker punch my plan. They have a million ways to kill off Earth, I've seen. It's the beginning of another. Is he giving birth to a celestial right now? Ajax knew the truth. Dang, so she's been responsible for a lot of death. There is no Olympia. What? Ain't that where Hercules was? Mount Olympia. Who is oh, this? Wow. Jarvis looking thing. Her? That looks like, uh, what's the girl's name? The sister of Gamora. Nebula. Nebula. It, that's her because it has the mole above her mouth. Wow. Okay, so you made a lot of them, basically. Oh yeah, that is her. The deviants to exterminate them. So intelligent. Dang, I thought that was the deviant. That was just the dinosaur. Mm -hmm. But there was a flaw in their design. They evolved okay. in predators um, themselves. Okay. So they're like the new ones. Cersei. Oh, man. What do you say? The like he, iron giant looking robot. She picked the nicest, like, heartfelt one to do that. Why? You knew she wasn't about to do that crazy junk. I know they should have picked me. <laughs> <laughs> the last time Erishim reset your memories, something must have gone wrong. Oh. So I could take a vacation to Fiji, you know. We're talking about a <laughs> celestial. We have, we're not going to let everyone on Earth die, right? I'm human. <laughs> yes, I need to go. I hope he was no. kidding about that. <laughs> oh, he was joking. So stop it or don't. I'll follow you wherever you take us. That place is chill. Hello, Sprite. I think we must learn from our mistakes and do better, sir. <laughs> you must not be a fool. Always taking care of me. I'll do it again. Oh, He just needed that one week in Fiji, though. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> Where do you I get that one from? Back up. That one wasn't near as nice, though. Oh. Dane? <laughs> Dane? In these situations where they break up, they never call each other back. <laughs> they just accept it. There's something else. Oh! oh Bro, I thought I was about to get answers. I was in the drama right there. Dang. He doesn't mind messing up the architecture. Very nice, sir. Are you mental? Hi. <laughs> you need that ring, young man. Young man. <laughs> and he's got a cell phone, so at least four. 
His finger pistols are kind of fire, though. <laughs> Did she get the cloak off, though? The spell or whatever? You can fight. You can do it. He said. He said. <laughs> With his eyes. Yeah. Come on, punch him, punch him. Dang, he slips the right. Mm -hmm. the block. Oh, there we go. Oh. I was about to say, ain't she about to attack him? Because she's on their side. Oh, nice punt. Oh, it said I got a new punt. Because it absorbs your powers. Uh -huh. Okay, that was kind of cool. She made it, like, shorter. That'd be so cool if you could just turn a water to tree. Or turn a tree to water. They're so synchronized, too, with that. Stay here. Say it. But is she, though? Is she still going red? I know. <laughs> Oh, the spirit bomb. Just because it takes more time, you know? <laughs> oh, wow. Is he going to grow back, though? Did you get that? Good. I did, sir. <laughs> Man, Icarus is bullying over here. He's going to me on the mouth. <laughs> he said Icarus. <laughs> yeah, he did, didn't he? Let's go, Cersei. Dang, dude, every time they fall in... Oh, that was a combat to Game of Thrones, too. They fell in the water and it was super deep. You know, it was supposed to be a little a small pond. What'd she do? Turn it to ice? Cersei! Are you alright? So that just showed she's just the most powerful. Yeah, that was nuts. Craziest looking tree I've ever seen. A damn weirwood tree. What's about Oh, no, 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 no! Bro, this is the best character in the movie, too. Don't kill him. Oh! Attack the collarbone! Oh, nice. He punched him off his own. Oh. oh no. Not him. Bro, oh. he just can't make it out. He always goes out tough too, don't he? We're two to two on great sacrifices. Two for two. Mm. Anytime I see his character in a movie, he's gonna make a great sacrifice. Man, die for Brad Pitt's ex wife. Are they still married? I have no idea. Oh, he's good. He's good. They're talking. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. <laughs> no. You understand now. See what so they was killing them without knowing they were killing them. Mm -hmm. They're the big pawns. They're pawns in this game, huh? The game of Eternals. I mean, he was my favorite character so far. He was my favorite character in this as well. Oh, they need all of their clan. Well, that proves that they're not like them because he just <laughs> said he's not powerful enough to take over their mind. But he's like, Having falls what makes us human, then they're like, oh, well, they're conscious, that makes them us. But then you just said that you can't take over their mind. So if they were like you, you'd be able to take over their mind. So oh, therefore, I, I buddy, they are not the like you. That, that is what he's talking about, the deviants. Oh. But the deviants aren't like you, bro. That's all I'm trying to say. Hiroshima. My technology hadn't helped them advance. So he helped them create <laughs> the nuclear weapons. Mm -hmm. Well, was he upset that all the people are dead or the environment is hurt? Oh, so close. Daddy, daddy, watch yep. Oh, he has a kid and stuff. Hey, guys. These are my friends from college. <laughs> they all agreed to say that. I like that mirror. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I feel like I get sick of it, but I like it. He's reading Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> a coloring book. <laughs> oh. Oh, there's a spell protecting his house or something? Or advanced. Vibranium. <laughs> Dang, just break the table. <laughs> it's gonna take like two weeks to get another table from there. That's funny, he's a procrastinator because he's lived so long. Right. This probably makes him that way. Yeah, because if you're gonna live forever, why even, you know? Why rush? Oh, so when they pulled up, Drew like got them to go because they had thighs. I was about to say, they look like they're being controlled. Yeah. That's their, what, the domo? Yeah, their ship. This scary looking triangle UFO. Oh, so <laughs> people oh, wow. were undercovering it. Well, they weren't uncovering that, but they were uncovering something. Dang, did you see that? It was temples and everything under there. What's your fun one now? Oh, she's just been waiting. Caliber. Oh, that's Excalibur right there. Arthur always did. DVD. There's Twinkies because they last forever. <laughs> I thought it was because that girl would be collecting all this random junk. <laughs> the only reason I know Twinkies last forever is so, because of Family Guy. A Unimind. A Unimind. So that connects all their powers. Mm -hmm. Nice. The way you know, I <laughs> Tia admits what the, it, the celestial being that's being created, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Aw, so sh she wasn't dead for long if it was six days ago because she, she was alive right there. Where is she? 
I'm so he knows where she's at the whole time. He ain't about to kill her, is he? Have I don't never know, because it seems like he knows about... Because he was the last person to see her alive. Don't get angry, Rob. Oh, yeah, it needs a lot of energy. This is why everyone's like, they know this was right. I'll follow you to the end. Oh, that's why he, he stopped him? Everyone. As long as it wasn't out by the barn. Yeah, exactly. Don't step in front of him. Uh oh, you about to fall. Like Natasha did. That's why he ran up and said, oh, it was a deviant. Right. Yeah, you're causing that doubt. No. Damn, I thought the fall was going to kill her. No, nah, she's an eternal. And she can fly up the mountain. She can handle a couple of kitty cats. <laughs> With that salt off, let's go. Dang it. You know, I don't know anything about shotguns. Sucking the soul out of her. Oh, yeah. So when, when that thing rehealed itself, it's because it did take her power. It's not because it evolved. It actually took her power. About to go set up the crime scene. Dang, Icarus. And he's taking their powers? Just sucking their energy out. Oh, no. Giving them powers. Well, he technically wasn't wrong. The Deviants really did kill. But, he, you know, he was in charge of it. So he was just loyal to the mission, basically. Yeah. He just happens to be a really good guy. So he Amazing really wanted to chill. carry out that mission. That's the way that he grabbed her hand. Mm-hmm. And then the same type of ruins like that, too. So the other guy's just at home being a cornball. I wanted you to leave this world in peace. You better run. About to kill the one he loves. I'm close to figuring it out. Oh! Not anymore. He lied to us. Hey, Jack told me everything when we left. But That's a long time ago. You know. What have you done? Because Ajax yeah, was yeah. good. Mm -hmm. I had to. She loved you. That would be hard, though. Humans. That's why he left, I guess. Wait. I'm going with you. Man, that divide. No, don't leave, bro. He has to his, his boss. No, come film for us. Um, maybe he'll talk to him. At least they were nice to him. They could have just told him to Look. bounce. Mm -hmm. Kill a celestial. Cersei. Cersei. We can't. So he's just going to try to put it to sleep. And that's the end. It's just going to be asleep. Yeah, good luck with that. Yeah, I get the reason now. I was so confused at first. They wanted to call it the Neuralink, but they can't. I like the brainstorm. That was a good one. You made that look easy. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. I know. When he did this part, I wanted to try that. This feels like Power Rangers. Yeah, it made me feel extremely culturally relevant. I just need everyone to know that. He just looked like a shooting star. Where's Drake? He was a shooting star. He just got him in the nuts. You see that? <laughs> Let's go, Eternals. Oh, nice. The Unimind at work. That was the sweetest. You hear how nice he was? <laughs> like, I should have done it centuries ago, my friend. I'm sorry to have to do this. Uh-uh. Oh, but they have the bracelet on, so maybe we'll help. He's basically being Matt Damon on Interstellar. Drake's gone. It's over. Remember when I watched that guy cook one on a, a pizza on a volcano? Yeah, he wasn't even on the <laughs> volcano. He was like, he advertised he's about to make pizzas in a volcano. You get there, he's like 800 feet away from the top. That's okay. Cooking on a damn stove. Oh, we got false advertising. It's okay. Yeah, he's charging like 50 bucks for those pizzas. <laughs> Dang. Enough. And you're icky, Icarus. <laughs> I think Icarus was the name of a bird on Assassin's Creed, you guys. You can tell me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm right. This man looks like an octopus man over here. The fast people always generate music, you notice? Yeah, hardcore string music. I guess they move so fast it causes vibrations and sounds. Well, I was like making a book for reference, but okay. And the skeet shooter. Damn, so she's kind of like Sonic, huh? Mm hmm. Okay, fast those. Isn't that funny? He tried to fly off and couldn't. He was like, You're not powerful enough to do this. How? Die. So that was Sprite, obviously. <laughs> Betrayal. Done in by the kid. You know anybody else who got done in by the kid? Got stabbed by the kid. Hi, so. He's here to live as one of them. Oh, yeah. And I never could. Ah oh, man. She is tripping. Oh. Drop. I was violent. <laughs> My jeez. Oh, so he, he tried because, but then Icarus had to put him into the ground or whatever he did. She gave it one more go, yeah. didn't she? Got slaps for it. Give me your hand. Oh no. There's a world I need to know. It's gonna it's gonna absorb her power. Ooh. Oh, slice and dice, baby. But why did 
that guy not account for that? Because he Ain't thought, that like what she does? He thought she was like tricked up because her eyes were all. Mm. Well, how does she manipulate him? Maybe the unit fire. Uni oh yeah, 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 exactly, exactly. Or she remembered. That's not good. So it's already started. Let's go, Cersei. So that is rising from the ocean. I think grew deep in the core where all the energy was on the planet. You know what I thought about? What if he made the Ten Rings? Fastos. Maybe so. Oh, that's his fingers coming up, huh? His hand coming out. Oh. Good idea. Is she chaining it to like stone or marbles? Marble, right? Or stone, either one. Uh-oh. Yeah, I was about to say, he, he's got to change his mind at this point. Their love seems a lot deeper and more like dramatic than the other. They're seem goofy. Yeah, her and Jon's nose. Oh, because she like needs his power too. Oh, uh, the unity. So basically we just, oh, yes. Y'all Eternals got to stick together. Yeah, that's basically like on Dragon Ball Z. I know I say it all the time, but just as a kid, yeah, I watched it as a kid, but they were like, I need your energy. And everybody on the planet would send up their energy to Goku and then he'd make a bomb out of it. Really? Yeah. And it would always take like 15 minutes of just gathering energy on the TV show. That's sort of what they're doing here. But interesting that they've been on Earth just for this one event right here. So this thing's going to be a natural formation on the planet. That thing's going to throw the planet off tilt. It looks heavy. Maybe we'll be the eighth wonder of the world now. Mm -hmm. You gonna start charging for boat rides? Stop all that damn crying. She ain't crying. What you crying for? Dang, he's Cap Captain Marveling out of there, ain't he? Wine into the sun. Man, you better go fix what you broke instead of all this self-loathing flying into the sun. What's wrong with you? No. So y'all can do that on other planets, maybe. I think I can make you human. Oh, that's what she wants, the right? So she can grow up? Wanted, you can have mm -hmm. them. Cersei's so kind-hearted in this one. Confused sometimes. Well, yeah. tell the little kid not to do it. Me too. <laughs> um, can you just go? What's the, what's the, oh yeah, we don't know about her. Sometimes she's right. iffy. <laughs> and they gave them steam engines. <laughs> when I get time off from school, you'll pick up some social skills. <laughs> oh, you didn't think you? Bad dog. Oh. Looks like someone's waiting for you. Man, you are to just move he's on, brother. Oh, so now that he's so gone. After all that, you still mm. can't change me and such a off. <laughs> I love you, Cersei. I don't care what you are. I have one I want to tell you. You've been cheating. What is it? He's king of the north. Turns out my family history is complicated. Cersei. Oh, she just got dialed in. Did you see that? Oh, no. <gasps> oh. Oh, he's pissed. Oh, he's taking her. He's got words for her. Sorry. It's the boss. Sorry. So who touched my thermostat? Oh, no. She's going to have to answer for all that, probably. The celestial. For the people of this planet. Well, oh, they say... Show me your memories. I, but your memories will show if they are worthy to live. Okay, well, what's the standard? And I will return for judgment. They gotta be worthy? Is like as a, a whole? Singularity? Like as a whole they have to be? I guess that's just the movie's way of being like, I'm coming back to judge humanity. Yeah, what's your family history, buddy? I'm a Stark, or I'm a Targaryen. Wait, there's end screen. 
but you know what I'm saying though? Mm-hmm. His family history is that he low key isn't a bastard. I think that's the first one we've seen directed by a female, Chloe. Oh, a girl directed this? I think so. Harrison. We have to go back. My ears. Now they put damn Tyrion in here. No more drunk teleporting for and you. And he's drunk. Uh, this is Prince of Titan, brother of Thanos. Brother of Thanos. Black Robert. What a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Well, you know, Ain't that nothing Harry like Thanos. Thanos. Ain't that Harry Styles? <laughs> you know, you really. I don't even know who that is. You know. I'm Eros. This is Pip. And you are as beautiful as legends say, Thena. What do you want, lads? Pip and I heads out, don't we? Is that Harry's house? It looks like him. Friends are in big trouble. We want to find out. And we know where to find them. I know Harry Styles has it is Harry hair Styles. now, but. So I guess since Game of Thrones got Ed Shireen to make yeah, an appearance, Marvel, Marvel wants Harry to go Styles. get Harry Styles. It's crazy. His name's Dane in this, right? Is that his name? He's very irrelevant. He's that boyfriend that's not relevant, so I don't know. <gasps> the cannon. Oh yeah, he loves artifacts, and that's like a sword. for that mr whitman who's a mysterious man okay guys that was eternals um it was to me a lot of cultural references that if i didn't start this channel i would have not known so maybe a lot of people would be like eh, eternals wasn't my favorite but for me i just felt like it made me feel like i knew a lot more than i do in other movies so every single thing i saw to me was like a callback to something else and it was cool but i do want to say it was interesting that there was like a group of people who had to come together to defeat a uh, something underwater because I I think like there's a lot of mysteries in the ocean. So for me as a person, I think it's like well, baby, it wasn't in the ocean; it was in the core. No, of the it came, but it came up from the ocean. Okay. And to me, that's mysterious. Sorry, our dogs are barking. If you hear that. But yeah, baby, you're saying lots of mysteries in the ocean. Go ahead. Oh, okay. So there's lots of mysteries in the ocean. So to me, I think it's interesting for them to add that. Well, I mean, of course it wasn't that. You said it was from the core of the earth, but you know, I just think it was cool that they added it. And also just a bunch of callbacks to history was cool in this one. I thought visually it was very great and I enjoyed it. I think that from here on out, we might either see the Eternals like to help us kind of like Captain Marvel does with like space affairs, but I don't really see how they're going to play into the multiverse. It seems it's like they keep making the characters stronger and stronger. Mm -hmm. I mean, I guess there's only one way to go up, right? But I like the movie though. But they did pick two of our really awesome characters in Game of Thrones to throw in here. Let me add that. <laughs> but I had a good time. I do want to say a lot of the Eternals kind of give me X-Men vibes too. So. I think to understand X-Men, we also could understand Eternals a little better in a way, because a lot of the X-Men, I didn't really understand their powers because they're X-Men or whatever, but these Eternals, they're kind of, what are they? They're not gods, but they're like... They basically just stole a bunch of things from the Bible. They were like angels in a sense. Mm, but, but they were created by, what's his name? I had to write it down because I forgot it. Arashim, but they were created by him. And he also created, oh. He's quote unquote God. I did notice the themes of like Greek gods and their names even, because you know, there's Thena without the A, there was Phasos, which is obviously a Greek name. Right. There's Icarus, which is a Greek name. It, it was, I, th I thought that was really cool though, in a way. I mean. Yeah, this movie also made a lot of references to mythology. <laughs> so yeah. it also took that. It's pretty good, man. I thought the concept was good. It was fun to watch. There was a couple moments in there that definitely made me laugh. So all in all, not a terrible movie. And I really am sad that the best character, uh, what was his name, Gilgamesh? Gilgamesh. Gilgamesh, there you go. He was my favorite, so it was sad to see him go. That I didn't like to see that part, but right. it was, I, overall, I, I like the Eternals. I, I hope we get to see them more in the future. All right, guys, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. We'll see you all in the next one.